Hola, hola, this is Leo. How are you guys doing? Um, today we're going to be doing a review for um, the foundation. It's, from, it's called the CC Cream. So this foundation is from Eat Cosmetics, which is IT. Uh, IT is sold in Ulta and also I think in QVC. So we're going to be doing a review. Um, I don't have any makeup on. This is my, my skin. So I want to be able to cover all of this. Uh, I have a few like dark spot and like acne scars. So I'm not gonna use any of uh, any concealers. So I just wanna be able to see if the foundation is gonna be able to cover this. Okay. Well, the benefits of this is that it has um, SPF 50, which is uh, sun protection, physical only. Uh, it's anti-aging, so it's full of collagen. It's a dark spot corrector, which is really good just because it's gonna help me with this. Um, it's a brightening and a corrector. So it's not only a, a full cover foundation, but also it's gonna help you with uh, any issues that we have. Okay, so let's see. I'm gonna be using my OMG fa um, brush foundation from It Cosmetics and the CC Cream. So let's try this a little bit. I don't like to use my fingers just because I think um, it doesn't look the same. So let's see. It feels really good. It's really hydrating. I'm not even gonna use. I'm not gonna use any concealers on their under the eyes. Let me see if I see me, guys. So this is the, all the foundation I'm using. It's it's not a lot, so. Let's see how much it's gonna cover. Ooh. Can you see my forehead? It's getting better. I like that. So the foundation is hydrating. I'm using um, Peter Thomas face wash for acne, so that's making my skin horrible. It's really, really dry and it's flaky. So using the hydrating foundation is gonna make it better. Again, whenever you use uh, liquid foundations, especially if they're, they are hydrating, you need to set it with a powder, just because you don't want to be uh, oily, you know? A lot of people get confused with the dewy look and oily look, so you don't wanna be all oily. Dewy, dewy is okay, but oily is not. So let's see. And again, same foundation, just a little bit, okay? Of course, I don't have to do like this part because I have my beard, which, you know, I save a lot of um, product. Like I said, I don't like to use my fingers for foundation just because I don't feel that it looks the same. Also, I don't like to use sponges just because they waste a lot of product. A lot of people love the beauty blenders. I'm not a fan of them. I rather use my brushes just because they're um, like these ones. They are antimicrobial, so they don't follow any bacteria. Okay, so this is only one layer. It looks really, really good. I like it. But if you can see, it looks wet right now. See it? I'm gonna do a little bit under my eyes just to cover my dark circles. Uh, normally, I don't use any foundation in my eyelids just because I'm really oily there. And if I do, uh, if I apply any liquid foundation, it's just gonna make it worse. So I'd rather not. The foundation looks a little lighter, but it's gonna, it's gonna change colors a little bit. Whenever I set it with a powder, it's gonna match me better. Let's see, so this is how it looks. I really, really like it. That looks good. And remember that this is only one layer of foundation. Uh, so for people that like more coverage, then you can do like a, you know another pump. But normally I did half of it, so that means that it's, you know it's gonna last you a long, long time. Again, it's a CC cream. Here it is from It Cosmetics. From It Cosmetics. 
I'm in the shade uh, tan, not tan, tan, okay? See? So now, just because my skin looks really, um, really wet right now, I'm gonna set it with a powder. So I'm gonna be using my E Cosmetics Bye Bye Pores, which I love it, see? So this Bye Bye Pores is made with silk. It doesn't, doesn't have any talc. Whenever you see any cakiness, whenever you see um, they set us into lines, or you know, whenever you use talc, talc is gonna, uh, which is TLC, it's gonna settle into lines so that it's gonna make you look like you have wrinkles. It can dry your skin, it can clog your pores. I'm gonna be using my uh, powder brush, which is this one, it's number, number eight, and it's called um, uh, the Ball Power. Powder. Heavenly looks. Okay, so again, this is from Eve Cosmetics. Antimicrobial, they don't hold any bacteria, which is also really, really good. So let's just set everything and see what happens. So this is called Bye Bye Pores, supposed to make your pores smaller. And my hair is getting the, on the way. So I don't like to have a oily look in my foundation, so that's why I set it. See? So the powder looks white. Once um, it touches your skin, it's gonna disappear. See? Buff it off. So let's see how my forehead looks now. Whoa, much better, right? See? Here's where I had like a big scar. It's gone. It's a little dry right now just because of the Peter Thomas face wash, but it looks really, really good. See? Remember that I didn't use any foundation in my beard part. But it matches. So I don't see any difference in my neck. So whenever you guys want to use concealer, you want you can set it with the powder too. So, so this is the look. Something really quick. I don't have any bronzer. I'm not gonna do my brows because actually it's, it is almost 11 when I'm doing this video. Um, I do want to say hi to my friend Just Manny. He lives in California, I think, somewhere there. Okay guys, this is the look. Very nice, my skin looks really even. I don't, like I said, remember how all this part was all, you know, dark. So it looks right. Better, it's not drying, it's not, it's not gonna separate, it's not caking. I just love it, see? A little closer. Closer. So my review for the It Cosmetics foundation is great. I do love it. It's one of the ones I use a lot just because I'm sensitive. Um, I do recommend it. For women that break out really easily, this is something that you can get on Ulta. Okay guys, then, thanks for watching me. Uh, don't forget to subscribe, okay? Give me a like, thumbs up. So any questions, just write, um, write it in the comments. I'm gonna try to answer as soon as I can, which, you know, I I don't have that many uh, videos right now, but, so, we'll see. So, hopefully you like it. This is the look. And thanks for watching, okay? See you later. Bye.